In this video, I'm going to play a game of tic-tac-toe. I'll be simulating the server and two other computers' clients connected on my one PC. You know, if you have two computers, you can use IP config to get the IP address of the computer that will act as the server, and then use that IP address with your client program to establish a connection. But when you're running both client and server programs on a single computer, you'll use localhost as the IP address for the server. And in these examples, localhost was set by default. I'm going to run the actual tic-tac-toe server program in Dr. Java. And then I've opened up two command prompt windows, player one and player two. I've also navigated to the directory where the code resides, so it'll be easier for me to run. And let me go ahead and run the server software first. So tic-tac-toe server is now running, and we're waiting for connections. So player one, I'll run tic-tac-toe client, and notice that it pops up player one's copy of the tic-tac-toe board. Imagine the line down here and there's two separate computers. Player 2, same thing. And here's player 2's board. All players are connected. Notice the status bar down here. It'll keep track of whose turn it is. Player 2 can't do anything until it's his turn. So we play the game. Can't go. And when one wins, it asks if you want to play again. And they each have a chance to say yes or no. And it starts over again. And that's how easy it is to play tic-tac-toe with yourself.